Hi, this is the city of Sunset Hills. My name is Wes Sears, the assistant city engineer. We're traveling westbound on Highway 30, and we're going to turn on to West Watson Road, which was recently rehabilitated uh, with new bridges and a micro seal, as we'll see as we turn this corner. What we are looking for this time around will be an extension of this type of project up through the uh, intersection of Rot Road, because West Watson turns into Rot, all the way to Geyer. And as you can see here at the pavement change that we are driving over at, at this moment is the micro seal that was performed in 2000. And here we're coming up to I-270. We'll go underneath the viaduct, underneath the highway, to the T-intersection. And as you can see, the micro seal and thus the extent of what was already done is at the intersection of Robine. You'll see that we recently completed a Nova chip to Robine, and it stops at what was affectionately called Pickle Hill. Pickle Hill is at 9149 Rot Road. We are continuing on Rot Road. Robine stopped at that T-intersection that we just went through. It was off to the right. But as you see, the pavement will change here. We are looking for possibly trying to get this section of road, starting now, replaced. There are storm sewers that exist on this road. This is Rot Road as we're heading up toward uh, Geyer. Uh, some of the roads that we just crossed was uh, Westmore Meadows, and here's Saller Road, both on your left-hand side. The first of one culvert that we would have uh, we've already replaced the wall in-house with our in-house forces. And that would not be something we would look for. But you can see some vertical alignment issues, a uh, potential sidewalk on the uh, left-hand side as we're driving right now. Again, another uh, head wall that was uh, replaced by in-house forces and funds, uh, as well as the guardrail off on the right-hand side. Sharp turn here. You see there's uh, uh, a horizontal alignment issues. Not really vertical alignment issues, but horizontal alignment issues that we'd be dealing with there. Obviously a water problem you see with the icing on the right-hand side of the road that we just went past. We're coming up to McLean. Now this uh, head wall that you see right here off on the right, uh, that would have to be replaced and we would not consider that and we understand it. But uh, something in along the lines of uh, a curb and gutter, uh, making better use of the storm sewers on this road, uh, eliminating some of the ditch lines that you see and a, a asphalt uh, repair and overlay, uh, maybe a Nova chip or something along those lines would be in order for this road. That comes all the way up to this intersection, which is Geyer Road. Geyer Road connects to Watson, and Watson, therefore, being a state route, uh, would demonstrate the connectability that we have. Looking project. back at Rot Road, this is Geyer. Geyer going down to those stop signs that you see down at the bottom of the hill. That is Watson.